My name for the record is Roxanne Kapoi Mohalei Kalani Stewart, born and raised here in Hilo. I am a Hawaiian. I am a Hawaiian practitioner and a Hawaiian kumu of Keiki and Opio, some of whom are here tonight to bear witness to these shenanigans, I mean proceedings. I represent myself, my ohana, my practice, Kia Kanaloa and Kai Palawa. In pondering the questions posed here, let us consider the previous practice of the federal government in their infinite wisdom in policy making and stewardship of their resources. Well, where, well, where informed decisions are made directly on site in Washington, D.C., regardless of the actual areas affected by these decisions. Where decisions are made in a timely manner, the apology bill came down swiftly 100 years or so after the fact, where decisions about resources and their sustainability are made with the very best intentions for the select 1%. Who would entrust in such rationale, conscience, and judgment? As for the state of Hawaii as a facilitating entity instead of the U.S., everything previously stated in regards to the great abilities of the U.S. hold true for the state of Hawaii, for they too would never have any standing on our Luakini. We all know that this is not the entity with whom these discussions should be taking place. We here will continue to perpetuate our cultural practices. We will continue to amass advanced degrees and work diligently to repair the disarray from the straits, from the state's most excellent stewardship of our aina and our kai. We await justice for our people and for our queen in the world courts, and perhaps then, we shall consider forming relations with the United States. In closing, my answers to all of your questions are ole. Pipi holo ka'au. Mahalo. Mahalo. I have Edwin and then Danny. Come on up.